Malibu. There's nothing that compares to going to school, looking at the ocean every day. Beach was a part of my life and I needed that culture. And that's when I decided to come here and say, you know what, I'm only playing beach volleyball. I don't want to be a hybrid player. Zuma is our beach. That is our home courts. That is something that we take pride in because we are a beach volleyball team. We're not a sand volleyball team. We want to play on the beach. Super windy conditions or just crazy conditions for beach volleyball. We like to call it at Zuma waves weather because we are the waves here at Pepperdine and we feel comfortable in those environments. Going up there and having that home court advantage with the weather, it's just like it's playing with a third person. I feel like Mother Nature is right there with you and we really do have a heart for the wind. <laughs> Off the court, we're in the weight room three times a week. The training, I absolutely love. Hang cleans are a big portion of that. Safety bar squat as well. But it's all the other little movements behind it. You can't just lift weights. Be a strong beach volleyball player. It's all the movements behind it, the little stuff. The little plyometrics that we do on the sand and in the weight room on hard surface. It all comes together. There's just something about playing a sport with no shoes on. There's nothing like gripping the actual sand when you play. It's like a freedom. You're on the sand experiencing the weather every day. There's just nothing like it, playing on nature, the actual beach. <laughs> Pepperdine is a Christian school. There's a lot of variety of convocations that we can attend. I look forward to going to surf convocations on Wednesday mornings at 7 a.m a little north of where we practice at Zuma. It's not just show up and jump in the water like you normally would for a surf session. It's listen to some worship music, listen to someone give us a message of the day from the Bible, and then we break up into small groups and we all share our highs and lows of the week and we pray together and, and then we hop in the water. And you know, it's just such a different connection that you get to make with the people around you that you are experiencing the ocean with. There's more to me here as being just a beach volleyball player, but actually I'm a surfer, I'm a swimmer, I love the ocean. There's just something about you and your board, it's like you're connected to the water, you're actually touching it. It's a total mindset and that's what resets me with the solitude that before playing beach volleyball or after playing beach volleyball, I wouldn't say I would play with someone that I don't even want to hang out with off the court. I want to hang out with them. I want to do life with them. If we're playing, competing together, I want to know more about them. And I think that's what makes beach volleyball such a cool sport. It's almost like a dance when you are on the eye level of play and you're successful. I would consider Malibu to be like a grandfather. There's a sense of wisdom and a sense of uh, maturity that I have been able to experience on my own because of the relationship I have with Malibu. There's this sense of experience here and a history in Malibu. And I feel like that's something that you gain talking to your grandfather or hearing stories that were before your time. I don't know what the future holds and hopefully you know, I am able to stay in Malibu. That's something I would love to do.
The three words that I would use to describe Malibu is be here now.